Have a good one. Okay. Hey, Mary Crew, this is James. So, I think you're in Madrid, and you're probably having nice weather. We're in Oklahoma, and we've got below freezing weather. So, rather than having these guys out on the patio, they're in our sunroom, our pool room, where it's at least a little bit warmer, and they can run around a little bit. So, we've got two girls here. So, this is, they're both going to be small, they're both from the same litter, they're both from creme brulee and uh, uh, Giovanni. Giovanni is a lilac. Creme brulee is a cream, carries blue, carries chocolate. Excuse me, she's a blue. She's a blue covered in cream, carries chocolate, carries tan points. So, let's see if I can get one of them off my arms here. Come on, girls. Yeah, they're playing with each other right now. Oops. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on, girls. Come on. Come on, Doctor. There's you, the French bulldogs. <laughs> there you go. I've got you now. All right. Lilac girl. She is a cream. She's what's called a platinum. What that is, it is a lilac covered in cream. And she has these really pretty eyes and a kind of a purpley nose. And she has a red eye glow. And like I say, she is a lilac, but she's a cream lilac. And she's a sweetheart. And um, she is. Well, she's smaller than Dolce, she's about the same size. Yeah, Where's Dolce? Yeah, they're both about the same size. Mum's 18 pounds, Dad's like 21, 22. These guys weigh like 6 pounds. They're charting right now to be less than 14 pounds fully grown. Personally, I think that's not even remotely right. I mean, 14 pounds is very small for a Frenchie. I would guess that she's going to be probably 17, 18 pounds would be a pretty big guess. All right, so then she just put her back down. Let's grab Dolce. Where are you, Dolce? On the side of the pool table. Oh, to the chest. You're gonna. We'll chase it around here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I got you. This is Dolce. So she is. She's a blue. Uh, she's a blue that carries cream and carries chocolate. Um, she's a really sweet, and she is a double A, so she's got this deep, 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 solid blue coat. And uh, I love her structure. Little bitty tail, just like you'd like to see. Nice chest on her. She's got nice ear set. They are not crazy big ears. I like her ears a lot. And uh, she's got a nice flat, can you see her face there? She has a nice flat face on her. Let's see how her bite looks. See how your bite is. Come on. You sure let me look at them. No, she doesn't like me doing this. Yeah, she's just right on the money. She looks really good. Um, so what will she what can she produce? Well she can produce blues, chocolates, uh, creams, fawns. She doesn't have any brindle, which is good. Um, so she can produce lilacs and platinums and champagnes. Can all come from this one girl with the right boy. And she is double A, so if you put her with a tan point boy, she'll produce tan point dogs too, with really nice tan points. Especially if they inherit the cream gene, they get really nice tan points. She's shivering, it's cold in here. Let's just uh, see if we can get the other girl here. Come on, look at her bouncing around. <laughs> Come here. I got you now. I got you. Okay, whoops, whoops. Oh, there we go. So you can see she's a bit smaller. Croissant, a little bit smaller. Not much, a little bit. So what can Croissant produce? Well, she can produce absolutely everything because she's got every gene you could possibly want. So Croissant can produce platinums, which is a lilac covered in cream, like she is. She can produce blues, lilacs, chocolates, uh, creams, uh, fawns, and she won't do anything to produce any, any brindles because she doesn't have a brindle gene in her. And sh uh, so she really has got the whole smorgasbord of colors in her. She is AYAY, does not have the tan point, whereas this guy here is du double recessive AA, so that will produce tan points to the tan point dogs. So there is a difference in that respect. Um, and structure wise, I mean, a you know, little bit smaller dog on all fidgety here, or croissant, a little bit smaller dog, but uh, not a lot smaller. And they're both, like I say, going to be small dogs with nice structure. So um, see whether you're interested in them and. Uh, uh, then get back to us and these guys are now they're 13 weeks old these guys are ready to go uh, and uh, um, like I say at 13 weeks not big dogs not big dogs at all so there we go I hope you enjoy the dream <laughs>
Okay, bye-bye.